people of the world. Today's video, I'm gonna be doing an apartment tour. This is a one bedroom, one bath, 745 square foot apartment in Buckhead, Atlanta. So this is more on the fancier side of town. Okay, my forehead looks super duper huge. And the eyebrows are terrible. But we're in quarantine, so I can't get them threaded. <laughs> Alrighty, so that is the front door. That's when you first come in. Um, and then this is just like a linen closet or whatever. Um, I keep my drill, some board games in here, like my extra luggage, my extra comforters. That's an air mattress. And then that lamp needs to be given away. I just threw it in here. Around, and this is the living room area. I'm gonna do a quick little 360 view for you and then we'll get into details so right here this is just a basket full of throws um, the basket is from Target and the throws are from random places from Walmart Target TJ Maxx um, coming along right here we have a 50 inch Hisons I think that is what it's called Hisons I don't know it's from Best Buy and I got it for $200, a 50 inch. And it is, I guess, considered a smart TV. Hey, you can see my reflection. It's a sound bar, the RCA sound bar. I got that from Walmart years ago. Well, this is a picture of my parents, I think in the year of 1992, if I'm not mistaken, before the kids. They were already married for like four years at that point. Um, right here, that's my crown when I won Miss Gold during the black and gold pageant, you know, by the alphas in college. I know this frame looks so old school, right? But this was the original frame that all of these pictures were placed in, and I think it's just super memorable, and I will never take it out of this frame, but that's just my mother there. That's me and my brother on my first birthday in the middle. And that's my dad, and then that's me and my brother when we were super, super young. So this frame is really sentimental. It's over 20 years old. <laughs> this right here is a full length mirror. Hey guys. All right, so it's super tall. I don't know how tall it is. Don't mind the pajamas. It's from Walmart. I got it for $40 um, like two years ago, but I know now it's like $55 from when I, whenever I go back and I see it. These curtains, believe it or not, um, I found at Goodwill for 10 bucks, you guys. These are super duper quality curtains. And so when I looked at the tag, guess where they're from? JC Penny. JC freaking Penny. Do you know how expensive JC Penny curtains are? The curtain rod is from what's that place called? Amazon. And most of the time it's covered, but I wanted to get a lot of natural sunlight, so. Um, this right here, this little shelf is from IKEA. I'm pretty sure you've seen other people have it. This little case is from, or this little piece of decor is from Burlington. Um, that's just a Ross candle. These two frames are from Ikea. This is a very, very important picture. This was actually not the original photo. This was, hmm, no, the original photo was taken and then I took a picture of the original photo and then I Took, I developed the one that was on my camera. So anyway, this is a very memorable picture of my dad. This was in the year 2001. I remember exactly where we were at actually. And this is a picture of me and my homegirls at a wedding. Yeah. Also this piece of decor is from Burlington. This picture, I don't know exactly where it's from because I got it from a girl on the app Let Go. So I don't know where it's from, but it looks like it might be from Ross. But it's just a little cute blue and gold. Um, this sofa is from Sofa Mania. It might look cute, right? But it's hard as hell and I might replace it. Um, all these pillows, well, the two gray pillows came with the sofa and then the rest of them are from Goodwill as well. So this piece of furniture is from Ikea. I believe it's $80, but fun thing is, this piece goes on top of that. And this land here is from Goodwill as well. So that is the living room area. Coming along here, this is my ring light. Uh, I just kind of store it here when I'm not using it. 
This little area here is like, I don't even know what you would call this, like my book, my read book area, like reading books. The candle going right here, mahogany teak wood. It smells like a really nice, strong cologne. This is me when I graduated in May 2019 from TJ Maxx, I believe. And then this right here is from Hobby Lobby. Of course, the W stands for winter. Right here, this is a picture of me and my sisters at SeaWorld, I think in 2018. TJ Maxx, TJ Maxx, TJ Maxx. Don't you like that? Um, and this little blum, little light thing, it actually lights up. Look, isn't that so cute? Um, I think it was from Ross. And then this was a picture of me and my dad and Tijuana. And this frame and that frame are the same exact and they were both from Ross as well. I got this from Goodwill for 25 bucks, you guys. And there's a tag underneath it, underneath the chair that says it's from Ross and someone paid, I think $120 for it or $130. So check your local Goodwill because you will be surprised. All right, so moving on to the kitchen. Um, I don't have a dining table, so instead I have bar stools. These bar stools are from Ikea. I had to assemble them, and they weren't that hard to assemble, but in the beginning, the first one took me forever. I think they were only like 20 bucks each. Yeah, they were like 20 bucks. And some cute little memories. I think my fridge is making noise, really odd. This is me and my family, I think in the year 2000 in Disneyland, in Anaheim. I'm not a big fan of my kitchen because it's it's tiny, but it, it'll do, I guess, right? Oh, the fridge stopped making noise. So this is just a paper towel thingy from Ross. My work water bottle, my hookah that I've seen to burn out. Yeah, that's just a regular little sink with a glove. <laughs> and we have my rice cooker here. That was only 20 bucks, I believe. It's just a regular stove, a regular microwave, and all black little tools. That knife holder and knife set was from Ross, and then this cheap toaster and cheap blender <laughs> is from Walmart. And then this door right here leads to washer and dryer. Washer and dryer, some clothes I need to be done. And my trash can, I keep it in here as well. So now let's make our way into my bedroom. I guess it's more of a princessy glam tie, if you want to say. All right, so this dresser is from Wayfair. And as you can see, I messed up with one of the knobs and I still have it, I just need to attach it back on. This is a very old plasma screen TV, 32 inch, that I think my mom bought for me maybe in 2012 or 20, yeah, maybe 2012, 2013-ish. These glass things are from Burlington. Of course, this candle is from Bath and Body Works and then this is from TJ Maxx and this is from Burlington. And same concept here, of course, this is the same exact thing as from there. Burlington, TJ Maxx, Bath and Body Works, and Burlington. This is Alexander. Alexander is six feet tall. And I got him on Valentine's Day 2019. So he's a little over a year old. Say hi, Alexander. <laughs> These curtains are just like the ones in the living room, except they're a little shorter. And I got them from Goodwill as well. And the, sh the little, not shower rod, the curtain rod is from Ross. I really love these kind of curtains, like the ones with like, they look like um, a shower curtain. They just swipe. Right here, this lamp, this little glam lamp is from Ross. And then these nightstands I actually got from a friend. It was so tough for me to find nightstands that were like affordable, that were still kind of glamorous. But I got these from a friend and bought them from her. My bed is the matching set to the dresser. 
It's from Wayfair. It's the Rosaline bed set. This is um, a queen. My bed spread is from, what is that called? Ross, actually. And I love it. And it came with those decorative pillows too. So. so these are the same as the other side. That knob broke too. I have to attach it back. Like I don't know what's up with me and, and knobs. <laughs> My desk is from Hobby Lobby. I got it a while ago but my degree is here. <laughs> Hi, I do my makeup here, and I know it's like kind of dark, but I bring my ring light and I just do my makeup here. This is my bathroom. I'm not a big fan. I'm not a huge fan of this bathroom because like there shouldn't be carpet by a sink. So yeah, this is my sink. This is my shower and my toilet is in here as well. One thing I do like about this place is my closet. I have a little, little rack here that just has some bags, my clothes, the jewelry holder, and some shoe boxes, some storage, some bags up there. I promise it's not junky. It's just that it's hard for me to place things properly up there because I'm so short. But yeah, that is the closet. I forgot to show y'all this. That is from Wellington. So yeah, that's my apartment tour. I'm just gonna do a quick little run of the place. So I hope you all liked looking at my apartment, trying to make it look like Pinteresty. Until next time, you guys. See you later.